Welcome back. From the Cobb Theater here at the MGM Brand Garden Arena, we certainly thank the MGM Brand and our partnership here with the Cobb Theater. Listen, folks, it's time. It's time for one of the most significant fights of the year. It's time for two of boxing's biggest stars, unbeaten, in their prime, coming together to give fight fans what they want. And that's a mega fight. Not for titles, not for a belt, but for legacy. And as they both proclaim to become this generation's new face of boxing, this fight's going down Saturday, T-Mobile Arena, and we're expecting capacity, a sellout. Closed circuit venue for the event, MGM Grand Garden Arena. You can get it at AXS.com to get your tickets. Let's talk about the fighters. We'll start with Gervonta Tank Davis, young man in box office. Unbeaten record. He's broken gate records at some of the biggest arenas, some of the biggest cities around the country. He's one of boxing's most vicious punchers. His 93% knockout percentage, one of the best in boxing. Also, one of the best amongst current world champions. Three division, multi world champion, 28 and 0. 26 of his wins have come by knockout. His opponent, King Rye, King Ryan Garcia. This young man's got blistering hand speed. He's got one of the most deadliest left hooks in the sport of boxing. He's won six of his last seven fights by stoppage. He has only gone the distance once in a 12-round fight. He's also unbeaten. 23-0. 19 of his wins have come by knockout. Saturday is the date, April 22nd, here in Las Vegas, T-Mobile Arena. It's going to be produced by the Destination for the Best in Boxing, Showtime Pay-Per-View. And again, the event is brought to you by Premier Boxing Champions, being promoted by GTD Promotions, TGB Promotions, and Golden Boy Promotions. Let me introduce one of the promoters of the fight. He is the president of TGB Promotions, Mr. Tom Brown. Well, thank you, Brian. Good afternoon. Welcome, everyone. It's happening, folks. Make no mistake about it, this is a super fight. One of the biggest fights that can be made in boxing. The best fight of 2023. It's just not often in today's game we see two young fighters, both undefeated, both in their prime, step in the ring together. Now I'm a matchmaker first, and we always hear about styles make fights, and it's probably overused, but in this case, with Tank and Ryan, it's never been more true. Oscar, I've heard you say quite a bit in interviews also about the styles of these two fighters. This fight will be an instant classic, an all-out war like Hagler versus Hearns. And the good thing is, in Tank Davis, we have Hagler. Thank you very much. Coming to the podium now is a man who will give you more details, obviously about the fight all the fights that will come your way on Showtime pay-per-view, certainly the programming surrounding the televised pay-per-view portion of the evening. He is the president of Showtime Sports, Stephen Espinoza. Thank you, Brian. All of us at Showtime are thrilled to be bringing you this fight in collaboration with the Zone pay-per-view. We're proud to once again be delivering the strongest schedule in the sport Showtime has delivered 14 marquee events in just the first 
six months of the year, and this is our ninth live boxing event in the last 11 weeks. It's one of the hottest runs in the history of Showtime Boxing, and this Saturday we have one of the hottest fights of the year. Tank and Ryan, two fighters with different personalities, different fan bases, very different styles in the ring, a battle of the two most popular fighters in the U.S., both huge draws, both of them coming off, very impressive performances. Tank against title holder Hector Garcia, winning by TKO, and of course Ryan last fought in July against former title holder Javier Fortuna. This will be Tank's 14th appearance on Showtime and his sixth straight fight on Showtime pay-per-view. And of course, we welcome Ryan to his first appearance on Showtime pay-per-view. Tank is a five-time champion, three different weight classes. He sold out venues in LA, Atlanta, Baltimore, Brooklyn, and Washington, DC. And in those fights, three of his last six have been one-punch KOs. 18 of the last 19 opponents have been stopped. I'll say that again. Tank has stopped 18 of his last 19 opponents. And before you ask about the level of his competition, last 13 opponents, the record combined, 318 wins, 12 losses. Ryan, of course, a very worthy challenger here. 23-0, 19 KOs, probably the fastest hands in boxing. Everyone talks about Everyone talks about his social media following, but that's not really the important thing. You know, don't get it wrong. Just because he's got a big social media following doesn't mean he's not one of the most talented boxers in the sport, because he clearly is. And everyone talks about his speed, but that's not the only thing. He has knockouts in six of his last seven fights, including over Javier Fortuna this past July. Ryan's two biggest wins, Luke Campbell and Javier Fortuna have come against left-handers, and Tank is a left-hander. So we've got a great matchup this Saturday. As Brian said, a special start time, 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. Tank is supported, Tank versus Ryan is supported by the Emmy-winning All Access, two episodes, over five million views on YouTube alone at this point, and of course, we will be producing our Emmy Award-winning epilogue as well. Showtime has a history of, long history, nearly 40 years of the biggest, most memorable, most historic, most important fights from Hagler and Hearns to Tyson and Holyfield to Chavez, Corrales Castillo, and of course the biggest pay-per-view events in history. Lewis Tyson, Mayweather Canelo, Mayweather Pacquiao, Mayweather McGregor, the biggest pay-per-view the biggest pay-per-view events in boxing history have been on Showtime pay-per-view. Our resume and our track record is unrivaled. And I've been fortunate to be part of many of those events, those historic, memorable, record-breaking events. And at this point, I'm convinced when all is said and done, this event will go down on that list. It's that big. Don't miss it. Thank you, Stephen. Next to the podium, Boxing Hall of Famer. He's the president, CEO, Golden Boy Promotions. He's the golden boy himself, Mr. Oscar De La Hoya. Appreciate you very much. Thank you to, uh, to the media for being here. I truly believe that uh, the winner of this fight will be the new king of the sport, and I'm happy that you're all, you're all here to see it. You know, as someone who spent most of his early life in the ring, I know firsthand what it takes to compete at the highest level. And this is the highest level. I look at Ryan, and I know he's ready. I look at Ryan's team, and they know he's ready. I look at Tank, and he looks ready. But when I look at Tank's team's actions throughout the whole promotion, I am left to wonder do they really think this guy is ready? Catch weights and rehydration clauses, late afternoon weigh-ins, all of these small petty requirements points to a team that looks to protect their fighter. 
And why would they protect their fighter unless they don't think maybe he's not ready for this moment? I really believe that Tank's team is worried he's going to lose. And when you're a fighter, nothing feels worse than your team not believing in you. And then you look at Ryan, who was so hungry, so willing, so ready for this stage, that he simply said yes to every request, no matter what it was. That is a confident fighter. That is a fighter whose team has his back. That is a fighter who is ready. And it's why you're going to see Ryan come out as the new face of boxing on Saturday night. Thank you. Right? All right. Oh, man, Oscar came out swinging. Here we go. Let's get this going. Just talking the truth. Coming to the podium now is a man who, listen, he comes up, he may have switched up his look a little bit, his swag is still the same. He's the CEO of Mayweather Promotions, Mr. Leonard Ellerbee. Thank you. The talk is done. It's go time this Saturday. Biggest fight in boxing. And Oscar, those comments you made. First off, uh, we believe in tank a thousand percent, a thousand percent. So when it comes to you, you have no room to talk about anything. We've been the A side in this situation, and that's how the A side carries itself. Okay. By rehydrating a fighter. Like I said, <laughs> like 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 I said, like I said, you've been asleep at the under the fucking wheel for many many years. I'm here, baby. That's exactly why. We took all your fucking fighters, and Floyd beat them all while you've been asleep under the fucking wheel, okay? And it's going to be no different this come this Saturday night. Okay. Tank Davis by KO, like I've been saying, and it might be early. Thank you. Right? Let's get to round three. <laughs> We're going to hear from some of the camp. Before we do that, I want to acknowledge Henry Garcia, father of Ryan Garcia. <laughs> want to acknowledge one of the partners of Golden Boy, Hall of Famer, one of the greats, Bernard Hopkins. Let me bring to the podium uh, one of the newest members of the International Boxing Hall of Fame. He's now the trainer of Ryan Garcia, Mr. Joe Goosen. It's been pretty interesting so far. Uh, <laughs> Leonard, Oscar. Yeah, I, look. Uh, I'm not going to have any war of words with anybody because um, the real war is going to be Saturday night between two great fighters. This is one of the most exceptional matches uh, put together in a long time, and I think the interest in this has been unbelievable. I've been in a few fights, and I, as most of the people of this day have, and I, I think it's something very unique uh, that this uh, fight is attracting so much interest. And I think that interest is going to be fulfilled Saturday night in the ring. Um, but I, I would just like to say this about my own fighter, because you know, I'll let Tank's people speak for him. Ryan Garcia is one of the most uniquely talented fighters I've ever been involved with in a half a century. And I, I'm telling you, the people that know me know I don't mess around. And I've never seen anybody train as hard, uh, focused as much as he is. Um, he has a deep faith. Uh, he has a deep faith in himself as well. I, I just can't say enough great things about him. And he's going to bring something very special to the ring Saturday night. I can guarantee you that. Thank you.
Coming to the podium now is a man who's been with Javante Davis since he was a youngin. I think that's what he calls him. He's his trainer, Mr. Calvin Ford. How y'all doing? Yo, hey. Good job. B. Here we go again with another one. Man, Oscar shooting shots, man. You know how it is on the A side? Yeah. I don't do too much talking. We do it. Be prepared. Saturday night, man, because it's on. It's definitely on. In the words of my partner, Kenny, we're going to put some knuckles on somebody. I don't train them for knockouts. I train them for punishment. I want you to feel it. I'm sending the message to all of them through you. That ain't gonna happen. We'll see. That's it for me. Mm-mm-mm. That was whack. <laughs> that was whack. <laughs> that was whack. That was whack. All right, coming to the podium now. Guys came here because you want to hear the fighters. This young man, unbeaten. You've already heard the credentials. He's electrifying. He's fast. He's powerful. He calls himself the king, King Ryan Garcia. What an honor to be here. Uh, this is a dream come true. Um, I'm seeing my face on the big screens at MGM. This is what I dreamed of since I was a little boy. And now I'm here, so I'm very happy. I'm very excited. Uh, I don't have much to say, really. Nothing's really in my mind other than staying focused preparing for today. I know that there's a big, big task at hand, but I know I'm going to come out victorious. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for all that he's done for me in my life. That's why I'm here today. And I'm ready to do what I do. Like you say, we do what we do. Well, I'm ready to do what I do. And I'm going to end him. I promise that. It's over. That's all I got to say. Coming to the podium, young man, world champion, and again, one of the most vicious punchers in the sport. You rank reps Baltimore. He is Gervonta Tank Davis. Uh, I just want to uh, thank everybody for coming out. I want to thank uh, Steve Espinosa, Showtime, Al Heyman, uh, Leonard, um, Floyd Mayweather, and my personal team. Um, we here. Enough with the talking. Uh, I'm ready to get down and dirty, baby. I'm from Baltimore City, and you'll see uh, how we carry it come Saturday. So see y'all then. Team, let's talk about it. Calvin, we'll start with the trainers. Calvin Ford, tell the people, in your opinion, why Javante Tank Davis is going to win this fight Saturday. I keep telling y'all, he say he's the king, and this vicious right here. I ain't never seen a king hold his kingdom down when you have a vicious crew come through. We coming through. You hear what I say? We vicious. We ain't just boxing. We doing this. Come Saturday night, be prepared. Be prepared. I got my man Kenny Ellis, the Bible. He's on it. Be prepared for Saturday night. I told you I'm sending a message. Not just, through, not just you, through the rest of them. Stop playing with my youngin. Stop playing with my youngin. Yeah. Joe Goosen. That's crazy. Same question to you. 
Tell us why King Ryan Garcia is going to win Saturday night. Well, I mean, I'm not going to divulge what we're going to do in the ring, obviously. Um, but what we've been working on in the gym, uh, Ryan has perfected a game plan and alternative game plans, if need be. And um, I, I, he, look, he is just an incredible fighter. That's all I can say. One of the best I've ever trained, ever. And I think his best is yet to come. And I think Saturday night, he's going to prove that. I, and I, I told him, I said, Saturday night, you're going to change the face of boxing. I believe it, and he believes it, and our whole team believes it, and his fans believe it. And pretty soon, everyone will understand what I'm saying. Thank you. Guys, Tank, if you can move your mic closer to you. Let's get the first thing out of the way that kind of went viral. I guess you guys were on Twitch the other day. You guys made a bet that basically the winner takes all. Now, I know you guys both have worked extremely hard for this fight. And the last thing a fighter wants to do is give his purse away. So was that just hyperbole, hyping the fight, or is that real, Tank? I'm trying to make it official. Definitely trying to make it official. Uh, his 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 uh, advisor called and, you know what I mean, begging that we don't make that, that happen. He was scared, you know what I mean? So I guess it ain't. Ryan, your thoughts on that? Yeah, same thing. I mean, uh, I'm a man of my word. I said it, and I was ready to do it, and I told everybody, let's just get it done. Whatever you want, let's go. I'm already ready to... I know I'm going to win, so uh, might as well take everything from him. But, again, I just feel like uh, I, I wouldn't do it to him anyways, even when I knock him out. I'm not going to take the money from him. Tank, listen, he's confident. He should be. And he's confident that he's going to stop you. You haven't lost. You certainly haven't touched the canvas. Your thoughts on Ryan Garcia saying that he's going to take you out. Got one of them Delusional. <laughs> That's it. Put the money up. Put it up, real. You also said this is the fight where I'm going to prove to the people I am what I say I am. What does that mean? And what is that? He's going to fail me, for sure. He's going to fail me. He's going to fail me. And if Ryan's going to feel you, but what does that mean when you say, I am what I say I am? What do you mean by that? I'm who I say I am. I'm that guy. I'm that guy. I ain't get all this way here from nothing. I put the work in. You know what I mean? I got them guys out of there. So here's yes, it. Come Saturday night, for sure. Ryan, watching All Access, there was a quote where Tank said, you guys are calling Ryan Garcia a star. I don't know if he's a star in the ring. He's a star on social media. What is Tank going to find out on Saturday night? Exactly why I'm here. I mean, you don't get to this position without having something special. Uh, any, any, uh, anybody with a clear mind can see that. Uh, I guess, uh, again, you just have to wait and see when I'm in there why I'm so special. He can't see it, but he'll see it once he's in there. It's, you're laughing, but it's, I'm dead serious. It's going to happen, and it's going to be over quick. So quick. You keep it Look at you. One punch. That's what? what you talk about, that one Speak punch. a little louder. I can't hear you. You say you keep relying on that one punch. That's all it's going to take. I just need a sing shot. Just what? this one. Just one. I just need this one. Trust me. The you left forget, I only need one, too. Okay. We get that too. That's fine. All right, then we both got it. We both got it. Like, come on, bro. I can't hear you. I touch that jaw. I'm telling you, going to sleep. <laughs> when I touch anything, you're going to sleep. I promise you. Once I touch that anything. jaw, I'm going to sleep. I will probably break your jaw. Facts. I feel like I'm gonna break your jaw with the hook. I just see. You don't even. You don't I just see you on the jaw. floor with a broken jaw. Go at the temple. Seriously. You go at the temple. You don't go at the jaw. Say what? I'm gonna break your jaw. I promise you. I, don't even bring your mother or your daughter. Don't bring them. 
Oh, you're going to see him. Don't bring him. Don't bring him. I'm telling you. Don't bring him. I remember when we were in L.A. Tank got up here and said, all I'm going to say to you is I'm going to take you to deep water and drown you. What's your response to that? I mean, they always talk, they're talking about, you know, I want to punish him. This man's never punished anybody in his life, man. This man's always losing. You don't punish nobody. So get that out of your delusional mind, bro. You're not going to punish me in no way, no chance. You're going to get punished. You got the lowest punch output in boxing right now. You understand that you're not punishing nobody. I'm the most accurate, too. That's fine. Don't but forget you're not that. Punishing I'm the most nobody. accurate, too. You're not punishing nobody, though. I'm the most accurate, too. So get that too. out of your mind. You walked into the wrong guy right here. The things you got away with before, they're catching up to you. This is the moment where everything catches up for you in every way. Trust me. Trust me. In every you're way, saying, everything's saying, catching up to you saying, Saturday what? night. Saturday, everything. Your whole career is going to come to a halt. Not, not finish. You'll be able to come back a good man. But trust me, everything comes to a halt on Saturday night. Finish. Okay. You're going to learn the hard way. Okay. You, you don't see it, what but you're going to learn you the hard what way. The you hard at? way is coming to you real quick. What, what hard way you at? In the blink of an eye. You're finished, yeah, then you're okay. going to have a lot to think about. Trust me. Make sure you've been practicing on keeping your hands up. Do that. Oh, you Make haven't sure watched you your tape, brother. No, you, you got to watch. You haven't watched your tape if you talk about hands up. All right. you, you, you delusional All right. about your defense. Trust me, right. man. Gamboa had you bruised up. Can you look at man. the truth for once? Damn. What? You are Stop real it. delusional, Ger man. Gervonta, this is, this is probably the first time you faced a guy who has been extreme. Don't get me wrong. You faced guys who felt like, hey, like I can beat Tank. But this is a guy who seems like, A, believes it, speaking it, and wants to show it. I think you kind of... He don't, he don't have the fundamentals at all. If, 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 if uh, Joe Goosen was so, so much of a, a, a great trainer, fix his, his fundamentals. This guy don't have no fundamental at all. All he's relying on is a weak-ass hook. That's it. That's all he's relying on is a hook. That's all. That's all he's relying on, uh, relying on is a hook. That, no defense, no nothing, no footwork, no, no, no head movement. He don't have no head movement, no nothing. He don't have nothing. Talking about he's a man. Get this. Get him out of here. Let me ask you both this. Get him out of what here. is this? What does this moment mean to you? Las Vegas, pay per view, in what should be the biggest fight of the year. What does this mean to you, Ryan? And you think to the sport? This is just uh, the biggest moment in sports right now. So. Uh, it obviously means a lot. The magnitude of this fight is huge. Uh, everything's on the line. Like I was saying, everything's already on the line. I'm in it already, so I'm just ready to go as deep as I, that I have to. And that's it. I mean, this moment is everything to me. I've been envisioning this for so many years, and it's finally here. So uh, words can't really describe how much it means to me, but uh, it, it means a lot. Yeah, we've been knowing what's going on through camp, too. Hey, you know no, what's funny about this guy? He's talking about, talk about, I that, got spies, though. I got this. But every time he talks, though, he ain't shit of a fighter, but he's doing everything you can to figure it out. <laughs> and it makes okay. no sense, man. This dude could send all the Judases in my gym, Listen. all that. Come, It's not going to stop what's going to happen. It's so sad. Okay. All his silly attempts. I need a rehydration club. I need a one to 36. I need this. You I don't need want to win the you fight. You everything for a non-complete fight. Why, fight. why do you need everything for a non-complete fight? Are you or are you, are you not are, a 135 you are fighter? You're putting your foot in your mouth. Are you so or are you not a 135 you are so fighter? Delusional, bro. Stop lying to the people. Are you I'm or are, are you not a 135 fighter? You trying everything to stop it? I'm sorry, man. You can send them all. You want to watch me train tonight? You can. You could come. Uh, your whole team could come watch. It's not gonna okay. stop that. What's gonna happen? Here we Leonard, go. Trash, wanna come? You want to come, Leonard? You're trash. You, come. you could pay all the people to spy in the camp. It ain't. I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing. You know what I'm. Doing. I know exactly what you're doing. Trust and believe. Hey, isn't it? And the mole is in your camp. Work, man. I trust me, Leonard. You're going to love me after this. You're going to we'll, we'll want to be part we'll of my team, Leonard. We'll, we'll wrap You're going to want to be this. part of my team, Leonard. We'll give you all the final, final word. We'll start with you, Ryan Garcia, for hundreds of thousands to the million of people that's going to buy this pay-per-view. You got a sold-out T-Mobile arena that have come to see this super fight. Tell these folks, final word, what they're going to get come Saturday night. His ass whooped.
What did he say? An ass whooping. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Ryan. I'm going to leave it at that. All right. It's going to be an ass whooping. We shall see. <laughs> Captain Hook is coming. Oh Tank, God. I'll give you the final word. Tell these it people. It was too funny to say tell, some shit. Tell <laughs> them what they're going to get Saturday night. Oh, man. I decided to fight, man. It's, I'm excited to be here. Uh, it's going to be great, man. We got two um, guys that's, you know, well, I don't know about him, but I'm coming with some stuff for sure. And it's a special start time, 8 o'clock Eastern, 5 o'clock Pacific time, showtime pay-per-view from T-Mobile Arena here in the fight capital of the world. Gervonta Tank Davis, Ryan Garcia. Guys, we got to have a face-off. Testing. Fighters only, please. Fighters only. They're still talking. Huh? Yeah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get some press interviews out of the way. We're going to have. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Javante Davis, King Ryan Garcia, Saturday night, Showtime pay per view. <laughs> 